Hey everybody, welcome back to Letterman Row. I'm Austin Ward, joined again by our very special guest, uh, future NFL draft pick, couple months away, uh, Damon Arnett. And there's a big hole to fill with you and Jeff Akuda both moving on, but Sean Wade chose to stick around. What yeah. did, were you surprised by that decision? Um, I, I don't know. I was prepared for him to take either decision for real, but I had told him that he was in. A, he was blessed enough to be in a situation. No decision was a wrong decision. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, with I benefited from me coming back, staying an extra year, and I explained that to him, and and he just saw how the process works. So, and him being being thrown out of the last his last collegiate game, I know that wasn't sitting well with him. So, uh, I know he's gonna have a chip on his shoulder. And everybody's talking. We were down there in, in Florida for his decision and his choice. He he wants to be that outside guy. You know, you and Jeff got to do most of that work. Yeah. How. You know, what's the big jump for him that he's got to make there? We, we know he can play anywhere on the field. Mm -hmm. What's it going to take for him to be that shutdown guy on the outside? Um, just for him to play on the outside, that's really <laughs> it. Uh, he has the ability. We all know he could do it. He just, this uh, situation we were in, we needed him on the inside, and now we need him on the outside. So wherever you put him, he's going he's gonna to excel. Now, so. All right, nobody better to break it down for us than Damon Arnett. Sean Wade coming back to Ohio State for one more year. Let's roll the tape. All right, Damon, so th this is now your uh, your former teammate, but your brother from BIA, Sean Wade. Mm -hmm. And if there's a interception of the year, I know you had one, a one-hander and a pick six, but this is pretty special right here. Yeah. What is it about Sean Wade that allows him to make these kind of plays? Um, <clears throat> just his his ball awareness, just when, when to look back. It's like he's right on point with looking back. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> his ability to to stop the ball's movement and then and then catch it all while falling. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's that's uh something that everybody can't do. Now this is what you know you've talked about this and you said that the transition is no problem. He can play anywhere. And this is he's lined up, you know, he's basically doing outside corner stuff mm -hmm. here, right? There's mm -hmm. no difference between Exactly. Okay. And it's actually harder doing it from from this position than being on like the outside because you don't have the sideline to use. Okay. Um, and there's a bigger, there's a bigger, uh, he can go wider in, inside or outside. At least on the outside, you know, he can't go too wide with the sideline being right there. So um, he was in a tough position, but he always makes it work. And how many times does a pick like this get replayed in the meeting room? Uh, not too many times. No, you just move on? Yeah, not, oh, too, man. Many, not too many big plays, you know what I'm saying? Like, if it's big, <laughs> it's cool, but... Like, okay, it was, it was just Rutgers, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I feel it. Yeah. Uh, there's one interception there for Sean Wade as we're trying to project him forward. It's not too hard. I think it's pretty clear that he's got the talent to be a star, and this is... This was another example where it's sort of the same thing you're talking mm -hmm. about. He's, he's run, turning and going. He looked like he the receiver. <laughs> And right. he's and he's just you know he's basically playing in an outside position, right? I mean, what's what's the difference? Right. This play and these routes are the, these are the ones you guys live for. Exactly. Battle one on one deep balls. Yeah, man, and his ball skills are great. So, and that was last yeah, like that was last year's too. He he better than he was last year. What's the secret to you know these these combo routes up there? And you guys are trying to avoid any contact. They're trying to maybe get a natural rub. Like, how do you uh, defend that? It's really with communication and uh, repetition at it. Um, if you rewind it, we he kind of knew that because they were both. He was out when number two was outside the hash, and he's wide too. You would expect something like that. Mm -hmm. uh, so just film study and reputation with it. Um, probably communicating before the route just to give him a heads up um, right. that it's coming. Yeah. And then finishing off here, you got to. Go get that high point. There yeah. you go. Got his head around. I know we always hear about exactly. that. <laughs> yeah, that ain't a problem no more. <laughs> <laughs> got all that fixed. And this is an example, too. Like, you've had one of these where the ball is hit. You've got to adjust. Like, Sean's going to have uh, more difficult picks than this one. But you know, there's what's the challenge, mm -hmm. too, when a ball is deflected and you're trying to identify and make a play like that? Um, you see, the receiver low-key helps him because he he not even – you can see he start, started walking – uh, when they got the tip, um, and Sean, he, you see the receiver? Yeah. Yeah, he not Giving even. Giving up, okay. Yeah, so <laughs> Wade, Wade sticking, sticking throughout the whole play, got, he, he got rewarded with one, so, um, yeah, it's really just staying tuned in all play, because those gimmies, you need every single one of those. 
Yeah, you're uh, not going to complain about a tip to Yeah, right? it's not going to say how you got it on the stat sheet. <laughs> <laughs> it's just going to say INT. All right, another INT. Sean Wade's been making a few of those over the last couple of years. He's coming back to do more. Yeah. I know Damon Arnett will be proud to watch him for one more year with the Buckeyes. Hopefully we'll have him back in here after he gets that NFL contract to still do some Buckeye cues anyway. Yes, sir. Damon Arnett, I'm Austin Ward. This has been Letterman Row Buckeye Q. We'll see you next time. Yes, sir. Thanks for watching. Subscribe below to get the latest videos from Letterman Row. We've got Letterman Live. We've got the practice report. we got rapid reaction. Hey, and you know we got Buckeye Q with Zach Bourne. For sure. we got recruiting breakdowns with Berm. we got whatever you need. Ohio State football and Ohio State athletics, we've got you covered here at Letterman Row.